Governor Murphy's visit to New Jersey Transit's bus maintenance facility in Newark sent a signal that bus riders are not being forgotten. When people think about NJ Transit, they think more often of the trains. But that's not even half the story. The fact is more New Jerseyans rely upon NJ Transit's bus operations as part of their daily lives than ride the rails. More than half a million ride New Jersey Transit buses every weekday. In downtown Newark, the service gets mixed reviews. I think it needs work. It needs work because it's like every time you're trying to get a bus, you don't even know which bus you're taking because the bus driver doesn't want to take the time to explain to the people where they're going. It's pretty much pretty accurate. They're always on time, so. It sucks. It absolutely sucks. The majority of our residents in Newark take public transportation. And the first, the primary form of public transportation they take is the bus. Common complaints around the state are that buses are late or overcrowded. Murphy's plan is to hire 40 more bus drivers, relieve overcrowding on specific lines in Bergen, Hudson, and Union counties, renew a focus on on-time performance, and allow flexibility to mitigate slowdowns caused by road construction. As I've said many times before, we know we cannot get everything fixed at once. It's going to take time, and it's going to take additional years of committed investments in NJ Transit to reverse the damage of years of neglect and mismanagement. Murphy's Transit Director Kevin Corbett says there is a bus driver shortage right now and the agency is recruiting. And for many of the rank and file here, get the word out that we want to you know, consider a good career in New Jersey Transit to embark on a new career or even a second rewarding career in public service with uh, you know, good, uh, good benefit programs that we have that you all know about. Complaints are heard not just in the cities. Someone tweeted from Clifton this morning, what the hell is going on, NJ Transit? This is a daily situation. East Brunswick. I don't know if anybody has ever been at the bus depot on Route 18 in East Brunswick in the morning where literally thousands of residents are taking that bus into the city to be able to pay their bills. This is, a com this is not an amenity. This is a necessity. Murphy wants to up New Jersey Transit's budget by $242 million dollars. He is promising no fare hike for at least the next 15 months. You are the transportation governor. You campaigned on fixing mass transit. Today, you are in the facility that not only maintains, but we rebuild buses and transit every day here in this shop. And how good is it to have the governor who is going to rebuild New Jersey Transit be in Newark shops today talking about fixing New Jersey Transit? Director Corbett told reporters that NJ Transit bus riders should expect to see improved service by this summer. Planned road work on the approach to the Lincoln Tunnel, however, could complicate that. At the Transit Bus Facility Maintenance Center in Newark, I'm Michael Aaron, NJTV News.